Hey guys, welcome back to Bronze's Math Club. Today we'll be learning how to find the volume of a pyramid. Volume is the total space that a three-dimensional shape occupies, and a pyramid is a three-dimensional shape. A pyramid can have a base of a rectangle, a square, an octagon, etc. In this case, our pyramid has a base of a rectangle. The formula for finding the volume of a pyramid is written right here, which is volume is equal to one-thirds times length times width times height. We need to find the length and width of the base of the pyramid and the height of the pyramid which goes from the apex down to the base. Once we have each of these values, we can go ahead and plug them into our formula to find the volume. So let's get started. First we need to find the length. The length will be of the base of the pyramid, which in this case is a rectangle. The length will go from here to here. So the length is pretty much how long the base of the pyramid is. So let's say that the length of the base of this pyramid is 6 centimeters. So we have the length. Next, we have to find the width. The width is how wide the, wide the base of the pyramid is. So we need to find the width of this rectangle. So the width will be over here. And let's say that the width is 3 centimeters. Next, we have to find the height. The height goes from the apex of the pyramid, which is over here, down to the base. So let's draw a line to show the height. So this is the height of the pyramid. And let's say that the height of the pyramid is 7 centimeters. Now that we have each of the values, let's go ahead and plug them into our formula and find the volume of this pyramid. So we have volume is equal to 1 thirds times length, which is 6, times width, which is 3, and times height, which is 7. First, let's multiply the length, width, and height, and then we'll multiply it by one-thirds to find our final answer. So we have to multiply 6 times 3, which is 18, times 7, which gives us 126. So we have volume is equal to one-thirds times 126. If we multiply one-thirds by 126, we will get 126 divided by 3 because 1 times 126 is 126 and the 3 remains as it is. So 126 divided by 3. Now we have to divide 126 by 3 to get the answer of 42. So that means the volume of this pyramid is 42 centimeters cubed. This is how you find the volume of a pyramid. Thanks for watching this video and we will see you guys in our next video. Bye!